welcome back to my channel. Cool intro, huh? So I couldn't think of a better video, review, whatever you want to call this, uh, to debut my new uh, intro screen. Uh, I'll be doing one of those for all seasons going forward. And um, my new uh, banner above is all different. It's all autumn. It's it's time, right? Let's go. You know, let's, let's go right into autumn in the fall. I'm over this heat. So what I have for you today is I have... A trio of candles from Homeworks by Harry Slacken. One of them is a returning scent from last year. Two of them are completely brand new sets, uh, scents. And these are part of the TSV that Harry's going to be doing, the QVC Today Special Value he'll be doing um, on July 15th. He'll be doing a couple shows throughout the day. And there's two trios. So he has the Harvest Trio, and then he has uh, the Holiday Trio. So this trio... Uh, we have Harvest Leaves, so this is the one, the returning candle from last year, and look at that, that is just elegant, beyond all elegance there, with the seamless wraparound label, absolutely amazing, with the gold accents. This is gold, uh, not real gold, obviously, but it's not silver, um, like last year, so here's last year's, this is gold, the silver is on the holiday set, so, um, and that's Frozen Blossom. That's freaking awesome. Uh, that's last year's Frozen Blossom. So uh, so there's this. So a couple of things have changed. Well, maybe one major thing has changed uh, with Homeworks since we last saw Harry um, bring out new candles uh, in the spring. And that is, look at that, four wicks. So we have an 18-ounce candle, four wicks. What does that mean? Does that mean the same burn time? Does it mean less burn time? No. It means the exact same burn time. So 30 to 55 hours on the old 3-wick 18-ounce candles, 30 to 55 hours on these new 4-wick 18-ounce candles. Now, just for size comparison, here is a Harry 18-ounce candle, and here is a competitor's 14.5-ounce candle 3-wick. So massive difference. This is 25 to 45 hours or so. This is 30 to 55 hours. And this will burn a lot better, a lot cleaner. You won't have any issues with it. It is just tremendous. Now, uh, so a lot of people had said, you know, last year's candles, oh, three wicks for 18 ounces. It took a while to pull. It took a while to pull. Um, so Harry went back to the drawing board and just did what he does best. He just reinvents, reinvents. So uh, he, they came up with this four wick um, solution. Uh, I have not burned any of these yet because I did just get these today in the mail. Uh, so I haven't burned them yet, but from my understanding, the pull time is like 30 to 45 minutes, which is insane for this big of a candle. Um, it took a while last year. If you didn't have it like a hurricane, you're looking like two, two hours at least um, to get these pulled out. So uh, I'm going to give you a rundown of the three cents I have here. I'm going to give you a little cold sniff review. Um, and a couple other things I just wanted to go over uh, real quick there. And I will have full burn reviews on all three of these. Um, Harvest Leaves is new to me. I did not get this last year. So uh, all three of these scents are new to me. So uh, this next one we have here is <laughs> Autumn Pinecone. Look at that. It's brown. Sorry, the lighting in here is uh, kind of awful. but So it's brown. Nice brown wax. Look at that. Very nice. <sighs> Amazing. Now... This next one is, I think, going to be a huge, huge hit. Like, remember how Smoked Pumpkin Woods was last year? Everybody wanted that set. That duo sold out almost instantly. Well, now we're talking Pumpkin Caramel Corn, right? This scent is so amazing with that gorgeous orange wax. Very nice uh, hue of orange there. So... Those are the three new cents, or well, the two new cents, but the three cents in the TSV. So, uh, like I said, that's going to be July 15th. And the holiday set is going to have Frozen Blossom, which is the returning candle, returning set from last year. Then the two new cents are going to be Mistletoe Magic and Winter Hearth. Uh, so, uh, TSV is a one-day only price. Now, my understanding with these trios, um, the two new cents, I don't know about the two returning ones, but the two new cents... Uh, from my understanding, you're only going to be able to get them in the TSV. So, if you any of these scents sound intriguing to you, make sure you put that pre-order button in. You order it on July 15th. They won't ship until the middle of September. 
Uh, that's because the, the heat and the wax and everything could you know melt the wax there. So uh, I would order that. I don't have pricing yet. Um, we'll find out soon enough uh, there or so. But anyhow, one other thing I wanted to note here is this is um, last year's pedestal, right? So here is frozen balsam on the pedestal, right? Fits fine, okay? Um, the footprint is the same. So rest assured, you can use all your existing homework accessories. Uh, you won't have to buy new homework accessories uh, if you don't want to, right? You know, um, but Harry always has new things coming out. Um, I know the pedestals are very, very popular. I actually just picked this up um, on an as-is deal on QVC. I got this one, and I got the, uh, they were the pine cones? I had the pine cones coming too. I think, yeah, the pine cones. I got those coming. Um, bird's nest one would have been nice, but pine cones. So, um, very nice. There will be a few more pedestals uh, available this coming season. So, it is the most wonderful time of the year. So, all right, let's get into harvest leaves here. So, what we have here? We have a mixture of pumpkin, uh, pumpkin spices, cranberries. Uh, not a tart cranberry, more like a, a sweet, softer cranberry uh, to me. And a little bit of uh, fruitiness, um, probably coming from the apple. It has apple wood and fir balsam in it. Um, you know, obviously from the cranberry could be coming the fruitiness, but it's more of a, that fruitiness is a little more acidic. Um, overall, very, very nice candle. Um, one thing also to note on the bottom of these is that this is part of the All Through the House collection. Um, same thing with the holiday line. So it's just a new name. Uh, all through the house collection, harvest leaves, fragrance notes, spiced pumpkin, right? Mandarin, don't really get too much of that. Uh, the cranberry, the fir balsam, and the apple wood. And of course, here it says, my four wick candles will be will deliver the most luxurious fragrance around. And we've got the masterly blended oils for a long lasting fragrance experience, proprietary wax formula, and the lead free wicks with the wick clips. So, uh, the thing about the uh, Harry's um, candles, they all have wick clips in them. So that means if you accidentally leave it on and it's almost down to the wax, it will almost down to the end, it will just extinguish. Um, there's no need to blow these guys out when they're done. You know, you don't have to save you know that last half inch or inch of wax like uh, some other companies say you have to, because these will burn all the way down. And if you don't want to play it safe, you can play it safe. Pop it in the freezer. You know, pop it out, and you know you can melt the wax there. Um, you know, break it off and melt it. Uh, how would you want to do that? So. Next, let's go to Autumn Pinecone. This was interesting. Um, Harry had showed this on his Instagram account. He showed a little video of him testing um, the candles um, in his house there. And he was talking about this one. This is really nice. So this has um, juniper berry in it and some eucalyptus. So it has a little bit of a cooling effect, a little cooling note. Um, not so much menthol, but I'm getting... A little bit of apple note in this too as well but you're also getting that wood so you know when you walk through the woods after it kind of rained it was kind of like that little um uh, that note in the air that musk in the air but this is a fresh it's not stagnant by any means it's very very fresh this does have oak in it and it also has um fallen pine cones i'm not i don't really know what a fallen pine cone smells like um I don't have any near me, so I can't go out and you know grab one and smell it. But I would imagine it has more of that woodsy note to it. So um, I am getting a woodsy, woodsy note to this, a very fresh woody note, mind you. And every time I pick it up, it, it smells differently because these smells just transform. And giving these uh, first impressions on cold isn't really fair to the candle because these guys got to be burned because they transition, right? Harry's scents are not simple. They are complex. So, you know... You can walk in one room, smell that scent, right? But walk in the other way, same candle burning, and you pick up something different. So that's where it, it's different. It's not just straightforward. Now this one, pumpkin caramel corn. I'll take a look at that there. This is, <laughs> if you guys smell the um, Harry's uh, or the caramel, the caramel candles that he did, the, you know, the ice cream cone or in the, the three wicks, it's uh, I don't want to say it's similar, but it has that that kind of the same almost caramel note in it. Uh, very sweet. I love it. But this has a buttery note to it because it's on that fresh pop popcorn or kettle corn, uh, what have you there. 
and it's just you get that pumpkin spice with it it's pumpkin spice caramel drizzled over this is what i picture in my head like if you go and you take some kettle corn uh you know caramel corn and then they just drizzle like some pumpkin spice on it or like some you know pumpkin uh not puree but you know like, like a sweeter pumpkin that is exactly what i get from this um because it does have the buttery crackle caramel so think of like a uh, cooked caramel not a fresh caramel, but a cooked caramel uh the pumpkin spice right and the fresh popcorn <laughs> this is to die for this is legendary <laughs> yes i said legendary on a candle i haven't even burned yet <sighs> I, I i really think this is going to go the way that pumpkin um smoked pumpkin woods did last year it's going to be a very popular candle and you're going to be wanting more and more and more of this this whole trio is actually to die for but this is oh this is amazing um so yeah that is what i have here i like i said i will have burn reviews of these i am going to try to have at least one of these burned a good good amount by um by sunday so uh today's monday i'm posting this on tuesday so I will attempt to have some of these burn for you guys so you're going into the TSV Sunday and you're like, I know what I want. I'm going to place my order so that I don't get, you know, shut out because it could, um, at least could sell out. You know, we don't know pricing. Pricing could be amazing, which his TSVs typically are. So um, if there's free shipping on it, that's always a bonus because QVC rarely offers uh, free shipping. So if there is free shipping, that's just an added bonus on top of uh, a discounted price. Uh, oh, the other uh, other thing I want to say. So um, last year, Harry did candles and sets of two, which he's going to be doing. So uh, these two are the only trios he's going to be doing. And uh, so that going forward, there's going to be two. There's going to be sets of two candles of the same scent. So last year he got some feedback saying, you know. Uh, I don't know why I'm spending $40 for one candle that I like, and I don't really like the other one. So this year he switched up a little bit. So he's going to do both scents, um, two, two candles of the same scent in one duo. And uh, that that's good for a lot of people because, you know, there were some candles that, you know, I even liked. And I was like, you know, uh, you know, I'll burn it or, you know, give it away. You can give it as a gift or so. But, um I haven't really found a candle from him that I just despise. I mean, everything I've had, um, even the tropical ones that I got, you know, like I said in my video before, like, I don't do tropical scents. And then I, I you know, picked up uh, Pineapple Colada over there, and I burned that one straight through. I loved it. It was so fresh. Um, I had planned to post that review before this. I didn't know about these. So uh, my whole week kind of got jostled around uh, just to give you guys some new uh, uh, information I want to, you know, you know, I, I didn't want to hold off. I didn't want to hold back on you guys. I wanted to just give it to you, uh, let you know. So I know it's a 13 minute long video, but it's homeworks and it's new fall stuff and I can't wait. And, uh, I want it all. So, uh, <laughs> guys, so thanks for watching. Um, please comment, like subscribe. Let me know your thoughts on these candles. Um, how excited are you, uh, for Harry to be back? I mean, uh, he's gonna be going full force ahead now. Um, let me know um, if you've had any. Oh, by the way, uh, harvest leaves, right? So last year, last year's fall winter collection, people were saying that uh, the scent throw wasn't there, wasn't strong, right? It wasn't filling the house. And then in the springtime, he switched the formula, doubled it, you know, and uh, we were all getting tremendous throw. So if you had bad uh, experience with uh, harvest leaves last year with the scent throw, consider picking this trio up because it is the new formula and it's going to be a lot stronger. Um, than before so uh with that thank you for watching thanks for st sticking with me for 15 minutes um almost 15 minutes so thanks for watching comment you know give me some thumbs up below um like subscribe please subscribe to my instagram as well at philly candleman same deal with twitter so and uh, i will be seeing you real real soon with uh more homework stuff other uh, uh reviews and things like that uh, coming forward so once again i thank you for watching and have a good day